few years ago, I co-founded with two other lawyers in Atlanta, the Georgia Latino Law Foundation, which is a nonprofit that helps Latino law students in Georgia um, basically just get a leg up and be exposed to more about the law. I, I know when I was going through my process trying to figure out what kind of law I wanted to do, I really didn't understand all the different career paths you could take with a law degree. And uh, I feel like in some law schools, they're very rigid about you go to a law firm or you go to you know the nonprofit route. But there's a lot of different routes you can go. There's a lot of different tracks you can do. And I, I'm just thinking, or the whole reason why I helped co-found this is because I was worried about other Latino law students thinking there's only one path for me. You know, I can only do immigration law. I can only do, you know, family law. Or I can only go into the government. Or I'm never going to be at a law firm because I can't get those grades. And really what GILF is about is providing that exposure that there's so many different things you can do. And also to prevent them from going to Barnes & Noble like I did and reading the whole career aisle on law schools and law, we do this great law day, which is really two days before law school starts, before the 1Ls and the 2Ls, okay, the entry-level students come in, and we teach them about law school. How do you study? How do you do a case outline so you're ready for exams? How do you interview? How do you get your resume ready? How do you network? What kinds of laws are out there that you can do? Because again, I think there's this misconception that all you can do is, as a Latino law student is immigration and family law. There's so much more that we need. And so it's really about exposure. It's about helping people, creating networks for people, reaching down and giving back, obviously, but also for my own selfishness, that I like to see more Latino law students doing well, being in law firms, being in the government, being in you know charitable organizations, nonprofits, doing well. 